Hi guys, welcome to a new video. This time um, we will be talking about what we call fluted glass, which is a very trendy material that we use um, nowadays in interior design. Now, in case you've missed it, because this is the basis of to create fluted glass, you need to create first a, an actual glass substrate. So if you missed it, just look at the video right here, just click on it, and I will show you how to create a glass material. Now, let's jump right into our file. As you can see here, so we're going to use this glass window as our reference. As you can see here, so it's already been set up as glass. What you need to do is to go in the Enscape Material Editor. Once again, make sure to select your substrate. Once you've done that, just like a Quick recap. To set up glass, so you need to put your ability color into black, uh, set down the roughness to roughly 2%, set the transparency to transmittance type, reduce the opacity to roughly 5-10%. And once all of that is done, all you need to do is to actually put your map. So there's one very specific map that you can use to create this fluted glass effect. It has like stripes vertical stripes go on one of these PBR websites um, where you can download this specific um, map. Now let me just share with you. So you go in height map, then in texture, click here. So if I've already saved, downloaded and saved this specific map. So right now I've renamed it as map fluted glass. So this is pretty much what it looks like. Select that and then just click open. And can you see here? Let me just show you again. Can you see here how suddenly the substrate appears now on your glass? So if I remove that, it's flat. And if I come back to my file, select it, and you're going to see how the magic happens. Look how stunning that is. Now you can see obviously here it is a bit too big. So all you're going to need to do right now is to click here on the image. And you can see here, we have the choice to invert. Well, here it won't change much, but just to invert the material and mainly to actually rescale your material. So click here on explicit texture transformation. And this is clearly too large. So let's just set it up as 0 0.2 and then same here, 0 0.2. And you can see right now we have something that is very subtle and very refined, which is exactly the outcome that we're looking for. There you have it. You can see now that we've got a nice kind of fluted glass effect. And if you zoom in, you can really see kind of the, the stripe and the uh, relief, which is really interesting. That's your way of creating a stunning fluted glass in one of your interior design projects. So if you like this tutorial, make sure to once again subscribe. Um, this would really help me. And stay tuned for more tutorials to come in the days to come.